Hey everybody, welcome to the turn 6 video for the Battle of Lhasa. As always, if you haven't seen the previous videos, go back and watch those. Watch the introduction as well as it gives you a good idea of the rules and the layout of the battle. Alright, moving into Green Sector. In Green Sector, TN decided to attack the Three Skull Fixed Base Unit, the Communications Array. But he also decided not to stick around after he was done. He did move two hexes off to the west, positioning himself more than a turn away from the Twelve Skull Liao Mobile Unit. In Blue Sector, everything was calm after the counterattack last turn. RW, T4, CC, and KK all left the sector using the captured dropship and our ships, leaving FT and BS behind. FT then moved forward to remove the 1.5 skull fixed base along the coastline, and BS moved forward to join them in the hex. FT then split off a smaller unit and sent them in the direction of Red Sector. Orange Sector saw little drama this turn. There was a bit of friction going on between a couple of the players, and it seems that BI has decided to break contract and they started moving towards the Liao units. The rest of the team returned back to the airport, hoping to defend it against the 20 skull attack. T4B, FC, and HQ all attacked the 20 skulls next to the airport, followed shortly thereafter by 4M, OR, and GM, hammering that 20 skull unit down to 5.5 skulls. The units returning from Blue Sector couldn't attack this turn, but they were able to set up a defensive perimeter around the airport. At the end of the turn in Green Sector, it saw the return of the enemy ships. Most likely they were in Red Sector gathering reinforcements, as they added six skulls of mobile units and one and a half skulls of convoy units to the communications array when they returned. In Orange Sector, the five and a half skulls remaining at the airport flanked around to try and join up with their larger units. Twenty skulls and twelve skulls both pushed forward heading towards storage, while four skulls of mobile units and their two fixed three skull mobile units stayed behind to accept BI's surrender. Blue Sector ended up being all quiet at the end of the turn, as no Liao movements were detected. And that's it for the turn 6 video, pretty straightforward. It puts the players in a good position to attack those large Liao units in turn 7, so make sure you come back and check that out. And as always, there's links in the description below for any videos that were recorded for this session, so please go check those out. Until next time, we'll see you later.